हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई होप यू आर डूइंग ग्रेट वंस अगेन यू आर मोस्ट वेलकम इन माय यूट्यूब चैनल वाइड लूप रोबोटिक एंड ऑटोमेशन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू स्कैन आई टू सी स्लेव एड्रेस विद ई एस पी थर्टी टू सो लेटस गेट स्टार्टेड स्टेप बाय स्टेप दिस इज स्कीमेटिक डायग्राम यू कैन सी हियर आई हैव कनेक्टेड बी एम पी वन एट जीरो मॉड्यूल इट इज कनेक्टेड थ्रू आई टू सी ओके विद ई एस पी थर्टी टू BMP 180 module is I2C slave, and we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay, we are going to scan I2C address from this ESP32 board. Okay earlier project now we will create new project go to esp idf explorer and click on new project wizard now start type scan to see slave address okay select its directory okay Number ten is okay. Now click on choose template and click on template app and click on create project using this template app and now click on yes. Okay, yes. Okay, close this. Close. Close. Okay, close. Go to main file and click on main dot c. Start here programming. Okay. So first of all, I will include header file. This is i two c dot h and this is sp log dot h. Okay. Now here we will configure i two c i two c config underscore t. Okay. This is conf. I will assign its configuration here. configuration mode mode is i2c master and sta pin is 21 and clock pin is 22 and here clock speed clock speed is uh, 1 megahertz clock flag is 0 and now i have enable as a pull off both pin sta and scl pin okay now i will call i2c parent config function i2c num 0 because of we are going to use i2c to see zero address of this conf structure okay now call i2c to see driver install okay same i2c to see num zero configuration mode this is i2c to see mode master rx buffer and tx buffer will be zero zero and zero let us check once its definition this is size of rx buffer and size of tx buffer and this is flag interrupt flag okay now print scanning i to see as okay now i will check i to see address so okay so here we are using for loop because of it will check all possible i to see address okay it will create the link with i to see and it will send the i to see address with right byte okay and now it will execute i to see command and check the response if response is uh, esp okay means one then it will able to communicate with that address okay so if address will be found then it will print if address will not found means it will not able to communicate then it will print okay now i have connected board 
and I will compile and upload okay so click on build flash and monitor okay now click on new art wow you can see scanning bus this is typo A scanning i to c bus found device at address 76 and then i to c scan completed i to c slave address is 76 okay in hex format so friends i hope you enjoyed this video if you really like this video so please do like subscribe and share thanks for watching